Eleven political parties and associations have rejected the new government that Tunisia's prime minister designate will present to the parliament. Politicians slammed the participation of some figures in the new cabinet who made several visits to Tel Aviv prior to the 2011 revolution. The participation of some figures in the new government is a betrayal to millions of people who are calling for the criminalization of any ties with Zionist and freedom of our Palestinian brothers. Over the past four years, thousands of students and unemployed graduates have joined the anti-Zionist movement to demand a ban on relations with Israel. We will use all legal means to stop the normalization of ties with the Zionist regime. The Tunisian civil society supports the axis of resistance against Israel. Activists call for unity among Muslims. The Islamic resistance is now stronger than ever. It can fight anywhere to stop the Tel Aviv regime. Zionist gangs are responsible for the sectarian strife in the region. Therefore, we must be united against this threat. Analysts argue that the condemnation of Israel's crimes and atrocities is a shared responsibility on the shoulders of Muslims and all the free people throughout the world. Activists say they will escalate their protests against Israel in order to put pressure on the parliament and the government to try any citizen who normalizes ties with the Tel Aviv regime. Adnan Shabashi, Press TV, Tunis.